questions because this is where it gets like really? funky. I thought it was uh, pretty good. Hello, YouTube. How's it going? It's 2019. We're super excited and we're talking about sealants. What is a dental sealant, you may ask? Well, a dental sealant is a preventative measure that protects the teeth from getting tooth decay. That's great, and we place them in children for between six to 12, because that's when they get their first and their second set of permanent molars. Why the molars, you may ask? Well, the molars have deep grooves, and they have a lot of nicks and crannies that food and bacteria and plaque can kind of get stuck in. So by sealing out that food and plaque, we can prevent the tooth from getting a cavity. That's right, and the second benefit of sealants is that most will release fluoride. And the reason that's important is because fluoride will help to strengthen the tooth, making it less vulnerable to tooth decay. So a couple questions that our, most of our patients ask us, and then we're gonna roll to the video of us actually placing a sealant, so that way you kinda know what to expect and the process of going about a sealant. First question is, how long did they last? And typically we're seeing sealants last between five up to 10 years, but sometimes we have to replace them a little bit sooner. Good answer. Second question, does my insurance cover it? And we're not insurance professionals and we won't pretend to be, but most insurances will cover it for that patient that's under 16. But nowadays we're placing sealants a lot in, uh, pa in older patients. We just have to explain what the price is and it's an out of pocket. All right, here's our clip. So you're going to need an ice light, which this will protect the tongue from getting in the way and keep the tooth nice and dry. Then you're gonna use some edge and that's gonna be used to help to clean the tooth. Then you're gonna need a micro brush to apply your universal bond and this will help strengthen the sealant to the tooth. And then you're gonna have the sealant material. And we're using Climpro sealant material, which is what we just carry in our office. So first off, you're going to dry the tooth. Make sure it's nice and dry. Place the ice light in to keep the tongue out of the way. And then you could apply the edge. And then the edge, you wanna cover up the entire tooth surface. And that'll just make it nice and clean. And you wanna wait 20 seconds before you rinse it off. has elapsed you're gonna get your high speed section and you're gonna rinse off the tooth and completely rinse off all the etch and then you're gonna dry it too to make sure all that water is not on there anymore that's right and then you're gonna go ahead and apply the universal bond make sure that you get it to all over that tooth all over that occlusal surface and then we're gonna lightly air dry the bond and activate it with the light Don't look at the leg. <laughs> okay, good. So now you've activated your universal bond and you're ready to place that sealant material. The benefit of this one is that it is... Fluoride. Pink. Oh. <laughs> so you can see where you're putting it before you activate it. And then after it's fully activated. You wanna check with a explorer just to make sure there's no little bumps in it. And that looks nice and smooth. Perfect. Thumbs up, we did a good job. <laughs> if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you wanna watch more of our videos, go ahead and subscribe. We should be posting a lot more in 2019. We're very proactive about the new year, new us. That's right. And then if you have any questions or comments, just go ahead and leave them in the comments section below and I'll be happy to answer this for you.